Hi guys, I wanted to just share with you the testing of my LA Colors Peel Off Base Coat. I did get a request from a subscriber to check it out and so we're going to check this out today to see if it actually works. I've had this polish for quite some time but never thought about using it as, as of late but we're going to test these this uh, polish out today. Now, I do have different glitter polishes that I'm testing. Some are more textured than others, but I'm going to have to test that out. LA Colors is more of a mainstream polish, so um, some of you out there may have indie polishes that are a little bit better in being a peel-off base coat. I mean, I only own one that, that I have, which is Oont, uh peel-off base coat, but this one I have never tried, so we're going to try that out today with these beautiful glitter polishes that I have. Now I am starting off with a just dry clean nails and I'm just applying one coat of the LA Colors Peel Off Base Coat. Now, as you can see, usually I've capped my free edge, but on a peel, peel off base coat, you don't want to cap your free edge. You want it to be able to lift off easily once you decide to take off the polish or the glitter polish. Now I'm going to just apply the first coat. Now I'm going to go ahead and apply the second coat of all of these beautiful polishes. Now this polish is so sheer, I decided to go ahead and use a sponge to put more glitters. And sometimes that's what we do actually when the, the uh, glitter polish is not as dense as we would like it to be. So I just applied that a little bit more glitter on to this particular nail just using the sponging method.
Here I'm applying oil to make the process a bit easier when lifting the polish up from the base. So we're gonna see how well this polish is tested. Now, I didn't allow it to dry as much as I should have, so this process may not be as great, but you can see it's starting to lift a bit. So I'm sure if I let it dry like overnight, the lifting process would be a bit better, but for the most part, um, just for this test of, within this video, it did lift up a bit. Now I noticed here as I was peeling it off with my fingers that the, the tips, for some reason, the tips just did not want to come off. <laughs> and it's, it's just not working. So let's move on to the next nail, y'all. <laughs> I'm still trying. I'm still trying. It's just not prying. So I just moved on to the next nail. And it could be that I just don't have the enough coats. Because usually I do apply a little bit more coats than this. And... Uh, but as far as it not lifting, I guess, when you're just washing your hands, that's a good thing. At least you can get a couple of wears out of it before it actually lifts up. But it does peel off. Now this one was a tough one, <laughs> I guess because it just didn't have enough glitter. I don't know what happened here, but it just did not want to lift. It did not want to come up. I'm trying and prying, but it is just not budging, y'all. <laughs> so I see that it will work better on uh, more of glitter polishes. See, I'm even taking my nail to even see if it could even be lifted and it's like okay i needed to coax it a little bit so it's probably more so with my application i should have probably uh gone closer up to my cuticle area when applying the peel off base coat to make it more easier to start the lifting process but once i coaxed it a little bit it did come off most of it but like I said my tips just did not want to budge now with this polish it was is it was easier to lift it for some reason I guess because the glitters are more packed together I don't know but it was easier with this one to peel off most of the polish but like I said with my nails the tips it they were not budging <laughs> the tips were not budging so if you decide that you want to purchase this or you see this polish, it may do your nails a bit differently than mine. It could just be the makeup of my nail. Um, so but let me know what you think if you'll be purchasing this or you are going to be looking for this. Like I said, this is an inexpensive alternative um, to a or an indie polish. So you guys, thank you so much for watching. Enjoy the rest of the video. I will be taking this off, as yes, you see, with my uh, acetone and a cotton ball. So thank you again for watching. You guys be blessed. I will see you in the next video. 
And remember to allow the magic to take hold and watch the magic appear. Bye.